Okay, so this is a quick side tutorial video, real quick subject, stouts. End of story, like, there's not too much to play on it. The main contributor and factor is single malt. So it started the whole thing. Uh, apparently it's an Ireland thing. It started with barley. Now, someone got creative and they used uh, milk. So when it says milk stout, it really isn't milk stout. It's just now, instead of utilizing you know actual milk through the process of dairy, they're able to create a lactic protein, which is like the lactose itself with enough sugar and enough protein to be utilized. Um, in a nutshell, it's different, you know. They, you can actually get um, like condensed milk and evaporated milk, and the crazy part is through that process, there's an actual type of plastic that they can get from it. So there's a natural plastic that you can derive from milk. And then lastly, oatmeal stout. That's exactly what it says, oatmeal. Plain and simple, single grain. If they just toast it really dark. And so that's your basic coverage on stouts that you need to know. Um, I mean, porters are right behind it, but they have uh, a different recipe that makes them a little different. Their body's usually thinner. They can be just as dark and sometimes a little lighter. And then be anything before that becomes a brown ale. So this is the basic coverage of stouts. And those are the main three things you need to know. And the most common taste profile, chocolate, toasty, maybe sometimes caramel if it's a lighter uh, toast. Um, some sweetness is in there and smokiness can definitely be in there. So hopefully that's helpful and uh, helps you decide if you want to be a stout person, if you already know you're, you're a stout person, if you want to continue being a stout person. So the lighter ones that are stouts, they usually are very carbonated, light body, not my favorite. If you're going to do a stout, just do it right. That's just how I feel. But if they do the right amount of portioning and the body's kind of medium and it feels like a more summertime beer and it's good for year round, cool. But even if it's hot out, if I'm feeling like a stout, I'll pay the price because it, when you feel like that dark chocolate craving, like you just want that but not sweet, it's a good adult dessert, basically. Enjoy.